<laughs> this is Jersey Pete. He's looking for a forever home. Now, did you just name him Jersey Pete? I just named him that. But I think his name was Pete, actually, from the records we have. I guess the spot. He looks like the little rascal's dog. Mike Hanish is just getting to know his foster dog after this truck with Petey and more than 30 others arrived at Pet Value in Emerson, New Jersey. Bringing them here emptied out a large shelter in Louisiana, just in time for rescued dogs from storm-ravaged Houston to fill it back up again. All the animals that we have here and that we personally have pulled, we're going to end up being euthanized to make room. I mean, that's the reality on a daily basis. But the amounts of animals that are coming in, the influx is just scary crazy. This operation is the work of Robin Ehrman of Pet Rescue, Inc., based in Tenafly. Feeling a lot of love. She figured out difficult logistics, oh enlisting volunteers from more than 10 animal shelters and organizations. But she says the heavy lifting was done by Tammy Jo Fowler, here behind the wheel of her rented van full of cages. I'm a mom. I have an autistic son. That's my job. But for a full week, it was her grueling mission of love to drive two round trips between New Jersey and Louisiana to save these lives. You know, it makes it being gone seven days okay with me because I know I made a difference someplace. Trip number three for this group is Thursday, and this time they are going into Texas to deliver these donated items and bring back more dogs. Whatever there's vetted, whatever's ready, whatever's healthy, we'll get back up on the next transport. They're all great dogs. They just need guidance. That's all. Dog rescue experts say owning one is a big responsibility, so don't adopt on impulse. If you worry, you can't follow through. You can also help by dropping off pet food and other dog-related supplies at the Pet Value Store, and it will get to Texas by the end of the week. In Emerson, New Jersey, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News. And to find out how you can adopt any of the newly arrived animals or for any kind of help, go to cbsnewyork.com.